Hello, welcome to another Java tutorial. Today we are going to discuss about variable declaration. You can define variables in two ways. One is data type name and the other one is data type, type name and you assign a value. Let's get started with some programs. Create a new Java class, test variables, and make sure you select a main method so it gets generated. So we have this empty class with uh, empty main method. We're going to define an integer and assign a value to it. Int i equals, say, 10. And now we'll go ahead and then print it. Now save it and run it. So when you save it and run it, you get 10. So that's the output value. Let's now uh, use a character variable, see how to do a character variable, char c, and then character variables need to be inside single quotes. And we'll print c, again save and run. So now it's asking for running, the output is a, because we assigned a to c. Now let's uh, do something for float. So float is a fraction number. Float f equals 10.10f. .10 Print it, yes, yeah, save, run. It, show, it is showing as 10.1. Let's put a big fraction and then see whether float can hold. So I'm putting a big long fraction there. It needs to be a high precision. Look at that, uh, float doesn't go beyond uh, six digits there. So it truncates it to six digits. If you want to have a good precision, we need to use double. Let's create a double D and then assign the same thing. Notice that here we need to assign D. So we remove the F after the number, which says float. Now save it and run it. Now you can see that the value, first one is the float, second one is double. Double can hold a longer, better precision. So when you need a good precision, you use double. 